Why do we get nervous when we present? Now, it's a question I wish I had a really simple, easy answer to, but quite frankly, we all get nervous for different reasons. But I think for a lot of people, it's about expectation. It's about an expectation of a negative experience. A lot of us catastrophize around presenting. We just think things are gonna go badly. We have a tendency to set ourselves up to fail by thinking, this is gonna be really awful, I'm gonna hate it, other people are gonna hate it, and that negative thought pattern sets in. For a lot of people, what we're actually nervous about is being judged, being judged by our audience, in particular, if it's an audience of our peers or colleagues. A lot of people actually say they get far more nervous presenting to people they know than to a room full of complete strangers. And I guess, yeah, when you're looking at familiar faces, you know that people are looking at you and to an extent they are judging. But you know what? Their opinion doesn't matter. In the words of that great philosopher RuPaul, other people's opinion of me is none of my damn business. As long as you know that you've presented well, as long as you know that you put the prep in, you put the work in and you've got given as good a presentation as you can possibly give, that's what matters. The other thing to bear in mind is that most audiences want you to do well. They want you to be a great speaker. They want to be engaged because actually watching somebody do badly on stage is excruciating. Watching somebody who is just a bag of nerves stand there and stumble and stutter and pause and not know what to go, you just think, oh, you poor soul, please, please, please let it end. Most audiences want you to do well because then they know that they are gonna get value from you. They want what you say to be relevant and useful and entertaining. So an audience actually are on your side. In fact, most people in the audience are probably sat there thinking, thank heavens that's not me up there. So actually they are looking at you with admiration. They're looking at you as somebody who is going to be a useful way to spend the next X number of minutes. They're looking at you as somebody they can learn from. They're looking at you as somebody who has got expertise or knowledge that they need, whether that's at a conference, whether that's in a meeting room, a board table, whatever the context. So over the next few videos, we're gonna look at nerves, how they manifest, how you can mitigate them, and really how you can start to control those nerves. We're never gonna get rid of them, but what we can do is bring them down and actually maybe even get them to help you present. If you really want more tips, please do subscribe while you're here on my YouTube channel and I will see you very soon.